Welcome back to the channel. Absolutely love to have you here. This is a quick market update for today. So Bitcoin just ran up to 65k and now we're getting a little bit of dip here. Uh, 62k so you can see the volatility is just absolutely crazy right now there are a lot of bullish news so for example uh chris bernisk as we pro approach ETH etf season the thing the question is not whether flows will match the bitcoin etf flows on an absolute basis but rather on a liquidity and network value adjusted basis will the flows into the ethereum etfs be greater or less than what we saw with bitcoin Sup if it inflows will be super crazier than Bitcoin, I mean, this is going to be absolutely crazy because I think that as like the Bitcoin leads the bull run, but in like historically, as it has got that you know price increase, uh, the money people start to go on a higher. Uh, risk coins aka low cap coins so then the money will follow there so i think that it has a real shot in this euphoria phase to at least go like around ten thousand dollars that's i think that's where i think that it will go hover on ten thousand dollars and bitcoin go to 100 to 120k uh, as soon as it crosses that 5k and bitcoin crosses that uh, you know 80k i'm going to stop buying and then switch to then we are officially in the leg up number two of the bull phase. So that's where you don't want to basically buy anymore. So, you know, and there's the thesis that if you follow the historical trends in cryptocurrencies, you can see that this euphoria phase would peak in 2025 summer. But now with the ETFs, maybe it's faster. I don't know. So we, we might, you know, peak at the end of 2024. But, you know, we will see whichever the case happens. Uh, I'm ready for both. <laughs> okay. Then Ilya Trade uh, tweets, crazy that so many people are totally off sides again. That's pretty crazy to me, by the way. We are at the next, so the next leg up, number two and the three. This is where the biggest money will be paid. And now people are off the markets. What? What? I mean, we are just about to begin the best part of the cycle. Many missed the entire run from 16k to 45k and only got bullish again near highs. Now they've sold the stone bottom and feel sketchy buying at these prices. Back in the vicious cycle of emotion, just buy and walk away. So yeah, I've been just adding, adding, adding. I started a new challenge portfolio to turn $10,000 into 100k, even up to $1 million. So 10x to 100x. Uh, if you want to see the portfolio, go to wolflobbies.com. Then eric.etf honestly not sure the weekly eat chart has ever looked so bullish bears are going extinct i think the ethereum etf um you know is it's a big deal this is super big deal so there was a one tweet where uh, i think it Ilya trades tweeted it like there will be altcoin etf so eat etf um i think personally like the eat i think it so it is the most decentralized and secure layer one with the, almost all the liquidity is locked up in the total value locked is in ETH. Uh, it's absolutely crazy. So, and now with ETH scales with layer twos, this Ethereum ETF is going to be crazy. And also there's the, you know, the burn mechanism now on ETH. It's some proof of stake. I mean, this is, this is a big deal. Um, so Chell tweeted, yesterday's close shows that bulls are back in the driver's seat, flipping these local highs into support now, holiday mode stays on, sent the coins much higher. You can see here, I'm not that kind of a chart guy, but what I do know is soon gaming coins will run so hard, your life will change forever. I mean, this is, uh, I, I, I was just about to go to sleep and I was like, this just popped into my head. I like this. <laughs> soon gaming coins will run so hard your life will change forever that's a beautiful one so i personally believe that and that's why i'm basically all in on crypto gaming uh, low caps and again if you want to see my portfolio go to bullflobbish.com and yeah right now the market there's a little bit of some people are taking profits um germany sold other bitcoin i think it's 54k or something like that and then now we are back at 62k but the volatility in crypto land is crazy there anything can happen here but if you look at for example, you know, let's look at the yearly. I mean, look at this. It is bullish. It is bullish. Now it's just a matter of time. Next leg up. I think the next leg up will start August, September. And let's see how the next leg up will uh, uh, shape the rest of the cycle. Will it just like be super crazy blow off top or will be just next leg up and then deep. And then the third leg up in 2025. Um, historically, the 
air for a cycle has been like six to eight months around that range uh as we are like eth trading around you know eth trading past all time high so you can see 1.4k so here 1.4k and here so february 2021 and then april so it's around like nine months but we will see if the, this will cycle will go super fast blow off top or we go the normal cycle I tend to believe that we will go the normal cycle and that's pretty much the best opp opportunity like basically one year of full bull market <laughs> from here to next October or July I mean think about that there's one year of full bull so there's insane amounts of money to be made um, and uh, craziness will go on but there will be like you can see here on this ETH chart crazy up and then deep up and deep so these for example right now if you look here we are you know with the volatility is super crazy but for sure as this you know for a phase really begins to ramp up as i make and as if you for example if you have like coins that will 10x to 100x profit needs to be taken anyway thank you so much see you at the next videos and uh, peace out and again if you want to see my portfolio go to wolflopes.com thank you